Welcome to Animal Care. I'm Emma, I'm 19, and I'm just finishing my level three animal management. I've been studying at the college since 2015, and now in 2020, I'm going to the University of Reading to study zoology, which is amazing. What I'm going to talk about is my sort of passions, what I want to do in the future with my career, and how the college sort of prepared me for that. I've been passionate about animals from a young age, as I'm sure that most of you are. I have a dog, I have rats, I've had a mouse in the past, I've also had rabbits, fish, that kind of thing. I've always had a passion for animals, but I never really knew that there was an educational element to it, or that there were courses that you could take to work with animals in the future. So when I was a kid I wanted to be a zookeeper and I knew that, but I didn't really know the impact on the animals in the wild until animal care taught me that. I learned about the dangers that animals face, from each other, from the environment and from us. And I learned about why animals are used. These animals around the world could be threatened for any reason. This can include climate change, habitat loss, the introduction of invasive species, disease, and the list just goes on. There's so much that we can do and we need to be acting now before it gets even worse. And the college gave me the skills to do that. Obviously the courses are designed so that you can get to know a variety of animals, find your passion, find what animals you want to work with in the future, and I clearly really loved exotic animals, zoo animals, and wildlife. So whenever an assignment allowed me to customise what animals I talked about, I would always choose the wild animals. And that's the thing that I really liked about the level 3 course, is that you can customise it to whatever you want to do. So if you want to talk about dogs, you can talk about dogs. If you want to talk about lions, birds of prey, rabbits, you can talk about whatever you want as long as it meets the brief. I think every course prepared me in different ways. The work-based level 2 is very practical, so you learn the proper ways to clean, feed and handle these animals. You get to do different tasks like grooming, administering medication and stuff like that which I think is really good to know. In the BTEC level 2, you have a mix between the practical and the theory. You get to design your own accommodations, design and put in place your own feeding plans for the animals. You also get animal first aid trained, which is really beneficial in the workplace. You also get to improve your own career skills, working on your CVs, and you get to write your own evaluations and evaluate how you've done in certain tasks. Level 3 covers so many different topics and it really helps you specialise in what you want to do. There's boarding establishments, which is all about boarding cats and dogs. You also get to train your own animal and perform behaviour assessments such as ethograms, which you'll learn about later. I think one of my favourite bits is the work placement that you get to do because you can do it literally anywhere with any kind of animal as long as you can travel there. Over the years I've done about 800 hours, maybe a little bit less than that, but it's given me so much industry experience and knowledge that I wouldn't have had otherwise. Over the four years that I've been at Bath College studying animal care, I volunteered at a kennels, a stables, a pet shop, an animal wildlife park, which was amazing. I've also spent a small amount of time at a birds of prey centre. Technically, this is my fifth year in college, so I've been here far too long. I would love to work in conservation one day, maybe in a nature reserve, maybe in a zoo, handling breeding programmes, stud books, that kind of thing. Anything I can do to keep the wild animals safe raise their populations and stop them from extinction. I'm currently on track to achieve a triple distinction star, which is currently the highest grade that you can get in your level three, which I'm very proud of and I've worked very hard to achieve. As long as I can meet the grades of distinction, distinction, merit, then I will be going to the University of Reading to study zoology, which I'm so excited for. There are so many different universities you can look at with different courses, so even if you want to do something different, like ecology for example, definitely look into it, there will be a course for you. And if you don't want to go to university, that's totally fine too, you can go straight to the workplace from these kind of courses. And you'll be really well equipped to do that. Well, I hope that you've enjoyed the video, I hope your virtual open day goes well, and Casper says goodbye!